By working as a historian for the city of South San Francisco, I used to hear stories from the old timers about how they slid down the giant letters on Sign Hill while they were children. So I got together with some friends in 1993 and we decided to have a party sliding down those letters. Now the sign says South San Francisco, the industrial city, and the letters are giant. They're 40 to 70 feet long, and they were whitewashed on the, the hill in the 1920s and by the Chamber of Commerce. And by the late 1920s, they decided they wanted a more permanent sign, so there was a bond issue, and they put the letters in cement up on the hill, and that's a perfect sliding surface. So we brought our cardboard and uh, put a little dirt down on the sign and we're sliding down the hill in September. It was in the fall, early fall. And uh, we had a picnic and then we're having a great party and all of a sudden there was a giant spotlight on us. And the bullhorns rang out and said, come off the mountain, come off the mountain. And the police had come because turned out it was the weekend before the big game, the big Cal-Stanford game. And traditionally, the Cal or the Stanford students would come and paint letters on the sign, either red or blue, that would signify their school and we're the top dog and we're going to win this game. So the police thought that we were those students. So we sent uh, our best statesman down to talk to the police and he convinced them that no, we were just ordinary guys and we were there to slide down on the hill. And they let us off with a warning saying you shouldn't be here at night and we didn't know that and uh, we wouldn't ever do it again. So uh, we had a great time and uh, it was a nice experience and Thanks to the South San Francisco police. Okay, thanks.